Big night in Tempe. The Sun Devils are currently taking on the Michigan State Spartans. Right now, the Spartans are ahead 6-3, but the Sun Devils have the home field crowd cheering them on, right? Thousands turned out for tonight's game, hoping not only for a Sun Devil victory, but also to avoid the security hassle that tied up the lines at last week's game. Yeah, that was an absolute mess last weekend. The lines were so long, some fans told us they didn't even get inside the stadium until halftime. That's all because of new security protocols. So we sent out Team 12's Nicole Zymek out to Sun Devil Stadium tonight to see if things are any better tonight. Nicole, was there any improvement? Well, Mike, a big improvement. We're told that those huge, crazy lines that we saw last week all started 30 minutes away from kickoff, and that's because everybody flooded in at the same time. Now, tonight, while there was an influx of people about 20 minutes out, it was nowhere near the levels of last week. We're going to experience it to the T. Fans excited for an evening of football. And even happier to see faster moving lines. But the lines now are definitely better. Um, it funnels in people a lot faster. A big improvement from just a week ago. These pictures taken by Mikey Gutierrez show a sea of maroon and gold jam packed at the south entrance. We had a friend meet us at the stadium and it took oh, him yeah, like an got, hour and a half to get in. Took, yeah, I was here for it. It was pretty crazy. You could barely no, no, even move anywhere. You... Aaron Wilfong was here at the peak of it, about 45 minutes from kickoff. It took uh, like a, about an hour and a half about. Among the improvements to the stadium, these new security gates. But a spokesperson for ASU tells us security measures didn't cause the backup. ASU says the main issue was everyone flooded in at the same time. And mine's taking a long time. Also, students now download their tickets to their phone, but the download was slow. I had heard like in the line, they're yelling out, make sure you have your tickets already up on your phone. So This time around, ASU says they changed a few things. They opened gates 15 minutes earlier, added a student only gate, asked students to download tickets ahead of time, and bought more ticket scanners. Overall, those changes did seem to work. Now, once again, at 20 minutes out, there was a con more congestion of people, but it was nowhere near what we saw in those pictures from last week. We're live in Tempe. Nicole Zymek, 12 News at 10. All right, thanks a lot, Nicole. And